The spring storm brought snow to several states Thursday, including Colorado. Messy roads made driving dangerous around Denver. Chief Meteorologist Eric Fisher of CBS station WBZ is tracking the rough weather. Eric, good morning. Well, good morning to you. Certainly a storm that is uh, creating a big amount of reports across the country. We've had over 250 severe weather reports from this throughout the day yesterday and into the overnight. Makes it the second busiest day for severe weather that we've seen in this young severe weather season. Here's the line we're watching this morning. A lot of lightning moving through the deep south. There's a line of tornado watches and severe thunderstorm watches along that particular line. Now, as we track this farther eastward today, it will start to lose some of that energy. So still some damaging wind gusts, still an isolated tornado threat from southern Ohio reaching down toward Mobile, Alabama, but in an overall picture, it won't be quite as active as what we saw during the day yesterday, and that's good news. Then we go to the snowy side of all this. We've seen a tremendous amount of snow across Minnesota and Wisconsin, and that will continue to move eastward into northern Michigan as we head toward tonight. And Nora, believe it or not, Duluth, Minnesota, sitting here on the 4th of April, has three feet of snow on the ground. Oh, my goodness. It's April, everybody. <laughs> We're ready for spring, Eric. Thank you.